Alright, hello everyone, my name is Sage and welcome back to our Pokemon Emerald Kaizo playthrough. And last time we arrived here to the 7th gym. And today we're gonna continue from where we last left off with this gym of course and you know... See if I could find my way through these puzzles and... All that good jazz, there are two ways I can go here. Okay, another another fight coming in, so let me just save really quickly before we begin with that. Oh my fucking god, there's freaking slacking. I hate to see that thing. Okay, well, let's attack with the crunch against this Espeon. And just with the Surf in general to damage the enemy team. Skills. Ah, okay, you get run away from the slacking, I see. This strat again, body slam will probably do a lot of damage, you know it's a fucking slacking we are talking about. Yep, 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 yep. <laughs> uh, okay, so let's just valiantly attack actually the slacking with the uh, overgrowth damage, leaf blade. It won't kill it, it will weaken it enough down so though that something else will kill it then hopefully. Espeon is loafing around now because he took that ability. Shadow Ball happens, sir. Okay, now do I reach in my flash to finish this? Uh, actually... Just thinking a little bit. <laughs> I'll put in Espe... Just to see what happens with the Surf. Okay, maybe I should have switched them. Slacking of my own. Why are you squeeze skill swapping it back to the slacking now? What the hell is the point with that? Okay, superpower might kill Samehara. Yeah, it definitely targeted Samehara there. Holy sweet sliver, kill yourself, slacking. Oh, fuck you. Well, I mean, you go down with the Thunderbolt. So it's still fine. Valiant effort somehow had I surviving that superpower. Okay, and in comes Hitmon Khan. Okay, well that guy will take surf now. And is that enough to kill the Espeon? Nice. <laughs> Pretty unnecessary critical hit there. But it's cool. And then what comes in is Alexam. Okay. I mean uh, somehow had I will go probably down here on the next attack. Let's attack. Let's attack the Alakazam because I think it's actually a little bit more dangerous than the Hitmonkan, just in general. And I will switch into Kushina so I can attack the Hitmonkan super effectively with the extra sensory. Mm -hmm. Ah, this Hitmonkan has guts, right? That's why you put it to toxic. I see what you're doing there. Oh, anyway, let's get this Thunderbolt in. Anim Alakazam won't take much damage from this one. Oh, it should do hit KO though. Okay. Alright. Well, uh, I don't know if Extensor can one shot this Hitmon Khan, but you know, let's give it a shot. Thunderbolt the Alakazam. I mean, Thunderbolt. Hey, what are you gonna switch into? No ground types. Fuck you, man. That's not cool. Oh, I should have attacked the Hitmon Khan with both of my guys. I guess. Yeah, it doesn't even kill it. Just a brick break will probably do a shitload of damage. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. But Kusina was still faster than the Hitmonkan, so it will go down. I'll Thunderbolt the Hitmonkan as well because you know I can't attack the Claydol with <laughs> electric type attack, so. Hopefully something comes in and takes the Thunderbolt though. If they lose the Earthquake... Well, Espa can take an Earthquake. Kusina will probably go down from that. Which is okay though. Oh, that's perfect. Okay, just use... Okay, that's not an Earthquake. That's fine by me. Because now Espa is still in full HP. Gets the Thunderbolt into the spell. Or, you know, probably takes it out. I think in this scenario I'll put in Flash. Use a Shadow Ball against that clay doll. Probably. This Thunderbolt should do good work against this fellow. Fantastic. 
Absolutely fantastic. Alright, so Shadow Boat is the last guy anyway. A body slam, I guess. Shouldn't matter. Well, I mean, this clay is kind of high level, so I'm not sure if we can one shot with the Shadow Ball. But maybe body slam is enough? I mean, though, I know a special attack is not that good, but it got the defense drop and it's in the red health, so should be no problems here. Yep. But you never know. I never trust anything until I see the <laughs> that HP to drop to zero. Anyway, interesting thing is now Flash doesn't have any more that uh, Truant because it uses the skill swap, right? Oh, it's still it's using another. Okay, I mean, sure. Wait, okay, now we are loafing around. Okay, I'm confused. I don't even know what ability I have anymore. <laughs> Whatever. I think Thunderbolt kills this thing. Yeah. Alright, well, we still made our way through that fight, so that's cool. Let, I'll just heal my team with the healing items, and then we are pretty much free to continue straight on. Yeah, so two double funnels back to back, and I think maybe these are actually the last fights before the gym leaders. Not 100% sure. That's just my hunch. Probably ignore the Wapple Fett for now. Uh, but the thing is, actually. Okay, I'll Ice Beam the Wop. Double Edge? Right. It might have the Mirror Code. Let's go like this. I'm thinking that it might use Mirror Code, so you know, physical attack might be a better option. Let's see how much the Leap Blade does against the Tlapras. Should be two hit KO. Aha. Hmm. Okay, I feel like there's a strat that I'm not gonna like here. <laughs> a few moments later. Alright. I don't think critical mattered. Alright, this fight was handled. You guys are annoying. <laughs> cheap, cheap tactics you're using. Alright, our team is more or less healed up, so let's just save the game and Take on the next double fight, see what uh, what they have in their mind this time. Let's... Iron Tail and Crush Claw. The Gengar still use Protect, so let's see, does this electrode outspeed us? Yeah, it still explodes. We are fine. Sure, whatever. It only takes that. Uh, Flash might take a little bit more damage out of that, but you know... Actually a lot of. <laughs> yeah, it still almost kills them. Why did the Gengar protect actually? Because yeah, it's effect, it's normal type move. So why even use the protect actually now that I think about it? Wasn't that just a waste of turn? Uh, anyway, ah yeah, this is perfect. I used the Crash Claw, so it was still able to hit that Snorlax. And the Iron Tail as well. Well, I mean... Yeah, this was actually good. Pretty good outcome. Man, Metacross is actually kind of scary. Scary though to see. I think I will be Iron Tailing here and... Well, I mean, you know, honestly, Flash will probably go down. Well, Metacross will use probably an Earthquake, so that might kill both of my guys. We'll see. Okay, couldn't take that. So, I think I'll switch to Kushina. Overheat the Metacross, it's super effective against it. And then, no, 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 no. who is the other guy who switch in? I guess it's Flash. I mean, Sasudera. I can attack super effectively with both of these against the Metacross to get rid of it. I'll just. I just played safety and overheat. Now Gengar is protect anyway, so that's fine. Hopefully I outspeed with both of my guys this Metacross so I can take it out without it attacking us anymore. Ah, okay. It dies anyway. So now there should be no more Pokemon on this side. We can just focus on the Gengar now. And whatever comes after that. And Kusuna gets to level 70, that's cool. Sodra gets to level 66. That's cool as well. Yeah, that's got protected itself. Plane Tower, Grunt should do the work. At least I hope so. Okay, that burn is probably unnecessary. And it has a Lumberry anyway, apparently. Now there again, shitload of Lumberries. Uh, let's just get the Grunt, hope that kills. Yes, perfect. 
All right, you're down. Let's see what comes in next. It does close, okay. Well, let's just... This thing is defensively pretty sturdy, but... I don't know how sturdy it is with uh, special defense. Well, it has... That. To stall us a little bit time. This is a pressure. Uh, I don't know. Didn't see any text on the pressure. I think at least it can have that. Wow, yeah, actually it has a good special defense as well. I can see that. Okay, impression doesn't matter. Uh, probably it uses another protect again. Just to stall off for fun. Oh, it didn't. Okay, let's just kill it off then. I believe I can get a kill. Yeah. Okay, let, uh, let's just see what is the last Pokemon then. Alright, the last one is... Ah, okay, it's a mystery. So this one is also rather special defensive, so let's just see what's gonna happen. It protects, okay. I don't know what these guys actually the main strat is. Everything has a protect, but you know. I don't get it. I guess I was able to sweep through the other side, so... Fast that I get it. I didn't get to see what the what these guys shenanigan is, or is it that everyone from the other side just explodes or <laughs> something like that? Okay, let's see. Do you want to use another protect? Of course you want. Nice. I mean, sure. Whatever. Yeah, I get it. You protect yourself. <laughs> I'm running low on power punch, so even if I would get to the team leaders uh, after this fight, I think I just have to go. Back to Pokemon Center to restore the power points. I don't want to use the power points. Restoring items, because I don't have many of them. So I would like to save them, you know. Let's see if the... Yes, the team leaders are the next thing to handle. So let's just... Let's just backtrack back to Pokemon Center. We heal up our team real quickly, and... Uh, then let's go see... How... What kind of match is it going to be? A double fight, of course, you know. I think that's pretty obvious. Probably... I think they might have still the usual Solar Can Luna Tone, but I don't know what else. Let's see what you start with. Ah, Latias and Latios. Fuck! Fuck! What the hell is this? The dragons! What the fuck are you doing? Wait. At least I have super effective moves. Of course you're faster though. God damn it. Freaking dragons. Okay, let's see what happens. Ooh, special defense drop, let's go. Thunderbolt, god damn. That's gonna hurt. Not a step though, so please don't kill. Ooh. Get the dice beam in. Should be good damage with the special defense drop. Yeah, okay, Crunch kills this now. So I think I'll just do that. I spin the Latios. Probably won't work, you know, but... Okay. Should I predict uh, Thunderbolt coming? I... I'll switch... I'll switch to... Let's go with Kushina. Crunch the Latios out of here. <clears throat> Alright. That gets us somewhere. Starmie! Uh huh. Luster Purge. Sounds something like that hurts. Is that a psychic type move? I think it is. Oh, damn. Uh huh. Oh, it's a crit. <sighs> Alright, let's get Flash in. I think what I will do here is. I will leap late Stummy and I will just shadow ball this freaking Latios. I don't think they will go down yet. Uh, but it still should be pretty good damage at least. But I don't know. Let's see. Leaves with the sliver. <laughs> Defense drop, okay. Ice beam! Kinda ex should have expected that, let's just say that. 
Mm, Goddamn, I lost all my fast Pokemon already. Now the slow ones are only ones left. I mean, this didn't work. I can say already that. What hidden power is that? I have no idea. One, we are gonna look around. Yeah, these levels are all oh, maybe just too much. Maybe I just have to run to level 70. Oh, that's great as well. Well, thanks. So, another last of birds, okay. Yeah, that last bird move, I think, is so strong that that alone screws us over a bit. Okay. Hmm. Looks like Crust Cloth Latius is probably the safest thing to do. Tammy, you know. Doesn't really matter what I do here. Let's just scout out as much as we can. can. That's a meditum. Hyperbump miss as well. That's a little bit of luck. Rock Slide doesn't even still kill the star me. Which is unfortunate. Let's loaf around. Now the Hyperbump hits, so that will kill a Tony. Alright. Brick break. Yeah, honestly, I'm not gonna even get a retry against this thing because I just I can already see that there's a huge level difference, so this is I think there's no use. Uh, I will just, you know, end this episode straight here. I will do some off-screen grinding, get everyone to level 70. I don't want to over-level again too much, so you know we don't ruin the challenge too much, but you know, just enough so you know that the next time we give this a go, you know, we can have a, at least a fighting chance. So yeah, thank you guys for watching this video. Remember to like if you enjoyed and comment down any thoughts you might have below in the comment field. And of course, if you're new to here, remember to subscribe. And as always, I will see you in the future videos, but for now, it's a bye-bye.